So I've been uh, trying to fit this chain tensioner to the bike and I can get the chain line fine with an extra washer but the spring tension on this is just ridiculously high. So I think it's meant for something a bit longer here and that's really what I need actually because on the smallest chain ring the chain is loose so I'd have to take a link out of it but on the biggest this is really a bit stretched. So what I'm going to do um, until I can have a rethink on, on a chain tensioner is to put the derailleur back on the bike. I've taken this apart in the hope that I might be able to switch parts around but obviously everything's different so you can't. Um, so I'm just going to put this back together, put it back on the bike and for the moment I'll just have a short tail of cable just adjust it here until the, the derailleur lines up with the one sprocket and leave it like that and that should work at the moment but that, that's a more realistic length that I need for taking up the slack because the whole point of having two chain rings is that they have a large difference in size so that I get a really big ratio range. So that should do the job for the moment, just a short piece of old rusty brake cable and I've adjusted it so that the derailleur lines up the chain on the sprocket properly.